the woman who joined ISIS in Syria and is now suing the Trump administration to allow her to return to the United States is speaking exclusively to NBC News for the first time since being told she can't return. Hoda Muthuna just spoke to NBC's chief foreign correspondent, Richard Engel, who's made his way into Syria as he filed this incredible report just moments ago. This is the Al Hol refugee camp, and this is where some of the ISIS family members are being kept. At this camp alone, there are more than 1,500 people from 48 different countries, wives and children of ISIS members. Among them uh, here is American-born Hoda Muthanna. Yesterday on the Today Show, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo said that Muthanna has no right to U.S. passport, that she has no right to the return to the United States. This morning, I showed Hoda that video and got a response. I read the papers and, and I know, in fact, that I was a citizen. And when I tried filing for a passport, it was very easy. It came in 10 days. So I thought I didn't have a problem. And I'm sure there's no problem. And I know my lawyer, hopefully, is working on it. And he will win the case. Do you think you'll be able to go back to the United States? Do you want to go to the United States? I prefer America other than anywhere else, yeah. And what do, you, what do you want to do if you went back to the States? What do you think will happen to you if you were to, um, allowed to go back? Of course, I'll be given jail time. Muthanna's lawyer disputes the State Department's claim that she was issued a passport incorrectly. Uh, Muthanna says she desperately hopes to return to the United States. She claims she was brainwashed online by ISIS and now has changed. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.